Okay, so to put the mop head on, you align the disc with the mop head and slightly step on it, and you'll feel it click. To take the mop head off, you put your foot on the material closest to the disc, only on the sides where this circle is, right here, either side here or here. Because it goes like this, and then you just go left or right. Okay, so if you look closely, there's a cross here, and then inside of the cross, there's a circle. The cross needs to be aligned with this cross here that's in the stainless steel ringer, and the circle has to be aligned with the agitator point right here to be used properly. For best use, you only need to fill up the bucket to the agitator point. Now before using your pole in the bucket, your pole must be straight. Now you'll feel the disc line up with the agitator. Now you could release the clip and just apply pressure down and it will spin. You come up on this side and it will also lock in with the cross. You, you can feel it lock in with the cross. It will fall into place. There you go. And then you control how dry you want the mop head to really be. Now you lock it because you're going to use it. Give your pole a little twist so that your mop head will flare out and you won't scratch your floors. Now just angle your pole and you're ready to mop. Remember, wash individually, hang dry.